the title of this video is Women's Mating Instincts Women's uh, Ability to select a good mate Is compromised Because of simps I'm gonna show you the extent of the damage That simps Did to destroy Society, okay Not just America It's not just in America that they Are destroying the Minds of women okay they are destroying literally every woman out there even overseas okay because i have seen some women turn evil okay turn evil once they have learned about this feminism shit so you know and women's mating instincts have been thoroughly compromised. Fucking depressing, it's you know. Notice this, notice this pattern, okay? They always pick the wrong guy first. They always pick the bad guy first, you know. Before they end up with the, the quote unquote decent guy. See what I'm saying? It's they have to mis make the mistake first. That no nobody, you know, no accountability on this shit. Their fathers don't put them on the, you know, put them on check. Their mothers they just you know treat them as a victim. It's always America, you know, it's freaking it, and the rest of the uh, the nations that are feminized. They always worship women, bro. Young women, they always worship young women and shit. Women to them is correct all the time, 100% of the time, even if they mess up with, with life, man. Even if they pick the wrong partner, they say it's the partner's fault. See what I'm saying? It's and a lot of a lot of these uh, bitches, they, they they truly believe that, you know, it's not it's not us that's uh, picking you, it's you picking us. Bullshit. Bull fucking shit. All she has to say, especially here in California, all she has to say is sexual harassment. Boom, and you, you fucking go to jail. I can go to jail for that shit. I've seen black men get slammed on the ground here in California. You think California is not racist? Come here. Come over here and see for yourself. You know? So I was in Starbucks that one time, and... So... This bitch starts yelling, you know. Starts yelling out of nowhere, and then the cop, you know what the cop immediately did? Grabbed black dude, slammed him on the ground, man. The black dude didn't even do shit to her. He was just standing there, you know. His phone was broke, you know. Immediately, this cop was fucking trying to pull his uh, handcuff, and he was gonna handcuff him and shit. No, I don't want to get in trouble or nothing, you know, I could, you know, I could have saved him or something like that, but, you know, uh, I'm like, nah, because I know these motherfuckers are simps, these fucking cops are simps, corrupt cops are, are simps, man. So if you ever live here in California, I don't recommend this place, it's fucking, it is not for a heterosexual man, you might as well be gay, you might as well be a fucking soy boy, you come here, you know. Fucking pretend that you're one of them or some shit. Because they are, they truly are the majority here, man. He's a pseudo masculine man and shit. Pseudo, they're like pseudo, man. That's what it is, you know. I can give you example after example of, you know, women overseas. You know, Filipino women, they're not, you know, they're not immune to this, okay? 
They're not, they're not immune to picking the wrong guy. As a matter of fact, I do know personally some Filipinas, actually a lot of them, picked the wrong guy the first time, you know, and then married somebody else. It's always like that, man. Even, you know, my cousins here, the feline female cousins here, even the, the women that I met here, they always pick the wrong guy first. It's like they, they're attracted to the, the thug, you know, the evil guy and shit. Eve is attracted to Eve, ill, okay? Being decoded like that and shit, man. The demons are being decoded like that, you know? Because it's year 2020. I told you, you're gonna have to pick sides. You have to pick, pick the side of the truth or pick the side of the fakes. Pick the side of the truth or pick the side of the lie. That's what it is, man. You're gonna pick the side of the masculine, the, the real masculine, or the pseudo-masculine. They study soy biology. Fucking soy biology, man. <laughs> you know? I was thinking like, what, what if we did this, you know? What if we turned the fucking table on them and shit? What, what if we accelerated their fucking degeneration, you know? Like, what if we did this, okay? It's just a, an example scenario. Okay, we know that these idiots, they want to emasculate men, okay? They want to emasculate men and they want to masculinate women, okay? What if we did this? What if we pushed their sons to be emasculated? Oh, you, you gotta be gay, oh. He's gay, he's okay, oh. We approach them and we turn them like this while they're young and then we turn their daughters lesbian. Yeah, you gotta be a man. You, you gotta be, you know, mm, you gotta be, mm, mm. You, gotta, you gotta stand like this. Mm. Stop wearing, stop wearing skirts. You gotta, you gotta wear uh, pants like this. Mm. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta take big steps. Mm. You gotta walk like a man, talk like a man. <laughs> what if we freaking, you see what I'm saying? It's, I'm making fun of it, but shit, you know? Like, what if we turned the tables around and we exaggerated, we actually supported their motherfucking ass and shit, man? What if we actually pushed it up like, you know, did it to them on purpose and shit. That's what they want to do. That's, that's what they want to get. See? They, they want to fucking emasculate all, all men and shit. I was even thinking about this fucking today, you know? Since they, they want fucking emasculated men, what if I invented, what if I formulated a, a sports drink? Let's call it prime time, you know, prime time or supreme or su supreme or some shit, you know? Or maybe a Testo RX or some shit like that. Test some, something like you know uh, that sounds masculine, but but the the, the opposite is like <laughs> it's true and shit. You know, I'm gonna use like a uh, estrogenic substances. I'm gonna look up herbs and you know plants and shit like that that you know emasculate you or some shit like raises estrogen and then lowers testosterone and then all of a sudden you know I'm gonna set it like it's fucking Red Bull and shit. And then all of a sudden they'd be like, hey guys, everybody's fucking <laughs> turning gay and shit. <laughs> That'd be fucking funny as fuck, man. They'd be like, what the fuck? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? It's and then and then for, for the for the women, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna sell something that masculinates them. I'm gonna sell something that fucking you know turns them into dudes and shit. Make them grow beards and fucking mustaches and shit, man. Or well, name it something feminine. Name it something like. Let's see. Name it something like. Uh, Astro X or something like that. Astro X, you know. Or a. Uh, Diva or something like that. Or, you know, some, some feminine name, man. So, what if we like excel? What if we really like push them to their max and shit, to their limits, you know? You see? So, so, you know, it's just a, it's something to think about, you know? Like, uh, like, what if we did something like that to them? And would they appreciate that? Would they, would they be, would they rejoice, you know? Would they be happy with it? I very highly doubt it, man. I very highly doubt it, because we still need this here, you know? They still need masculine men out here, man. Like, who's gonna fix the, these roads, you know? construction who's gonna do the dirty jobs and shit they're, they're not gonna fucking do that 
those kinds of manual labor kind of jobs, you know? Uh, something to think about. Peace out.